Hello everyone. Welcome back to my channel Learn Now from your learning partner. In this video, we'll be learning how to add a new column to an Excel file in Pandas. Accessing our Excel file is simple. Just double-click on it, and it will automatically open with Microsoft Office. Once it's open, you will see two columns labeled Column 1 and Column 2. So let's start with Python. First, let's open the Excel file in Pandas. Import Pandas as PD. Load the Excel file by using readcsv function. Display the data frame by using printdf.head function. This code is used to display the first few rows of a data frame, which is a two-dimensional table-like data structure. The head function is a method of the pandas library that allows you to display the top rows of a data frame. By default, it displays the first five rows of the data frame. This is a useful way to quickly inspect the data and get a sense of what it looks like. In a large data set, it can also help you identify any potential issues or errors early on. Now, let's say we want to add a new column named Total that will contain the sum of two existing columns, Column 1 and Column 2. We can do this by using the Assign method of Pandas. Here's an example code. Firstly, we will open up our Excel sheet and observe that there is no Total column. Instead, there are just Column 1 and Column 2, each containing a set of numbers. To generate a new column that sums up the two existing columns, execute the following code. After running the code, a new column labeled Total will be created, over here revealing the calculated results. Add a new column to the data frame using df.assign function. DFAssign is a powerful method in the Python Pandas library that allows you to create new columns in a data frame and assign values to them. One of the great things about DFAssign is that it returns a new data frame with the new columns added, so you don't need to modify the original data frame. This makes it a very flexible method that you can use in a variety of situations. You can also use DFAssign to create new columns based on existing columns in the data frame. For example, we will create a new column that is the sum of two existing columns. Display the updated data frame print, df.head. head. As you can see, we have added a new column named total to the data frame by using the assign method. The new column contains the sum of the values in the column 1 and column 2. Finally, let's save the updated data frame to a new Excel file. We can do this by using the df.toCSV method of pandas. Here's an example code. Use index to false to exclude the data frame's index from the CSV file. To verify the results, navigate to the file path where the CSV file was saved and open it by double-clicking on it and it will open with Microsoft Office. Hence, we can see the new column is added. Congratulations! You have now mastered the process of adding a new column to an existing Excel file with Pandas. Keep an eye out for our upcoming tutorial, which will cover creating a new column from an existing column.